Now here's one that's totally unsurprising, Aura. Yes, I know this is the most used skin of Fortnite. Everyone wears it. And that's the reason why a ton of people just don't like her. It has nothing to do with the skin itself. It's how she's used. Players are always dying to sweat to pros who wear Aura every single day. So it's no surprise that so many players hate her. It's also no shock that Shang-Chi is on this list. Probably the most hated Marvel skin in the entire game. They dropped him to celebrate the release of the movie and everyone had just left the theater desperate to play as him in Fortnite. Only to log in to find out that he looks like huh? this. Shang-Chi looks so good in the movie only for Fortnite to completely dumb him down to the comic version, which barely anyone recognized. But can you believe how much Flytrap was sold for? This guy is legendary rarity despite being one of the ugliest outfits in the game, which means you have to cough up 2,000 V-Bucks. He has no edit styles either, and when he dropped, he didn't even have a back bling. Fortnite was seriously charging 2,000 V-Bucks for a skin with nothing else to offer. It's no wonder that people despise this outfit after so many years. And the same reason that everyone hates Gugumon is why Cause gets such a bad rep. Arguably, he's a more established artist, but it was another collab that just didn't make sense. Not only did they add cause to the game, they brought him back with a Peely version, which people were not happy about. And the skin itself ain't even that bad, but the fact it's a random crossover left a sour taste in players' mouths. Just like it would if you ate mincemeat, probably the freakiest skin in Fortnite. The amount of detail that went into this outfit is actually insane if you look at it for more than five seconds. There is nothing wrong with his design, except it's simply terrifying. Kind of the point of a Fortnite Mare skin to be honest, but once Halloween is over, what do you even do with this guy? He just collects dust in the locker and gives you nightmares every time you scroll past. On the opposite end of the spectrum is an outfit that no one takes seriously, Grimbles. We probably should have guessed that a garden gnome in Fortnite would have looked great, but now he's become iconic for being goofy. Nobody wears this unless they're trolling their teammates, or maybe they just really like gnomes, I guess. Speaking of meme sets, I gotta talk about beast mode. Not only do these guys look ridiculous, but they were huge outfits, so it actually gave you a disadvantage to use them. Whether you're a metal rhino or whatever animal this is, you can see why players don't like the set. Same goes for Giddy F. This guy is obviously not meant to be taken seriously. It's a Halloween costume skin and when he dropped, everyone thought it was pretty funny. Obviously, I love when Epic just go wild to make outfits based on insane ideas, but in practice, when you have Giddy F equipped, you can barely see in front of you. On the flip side though, it is hilarious to do emotes with this guy. I'm sensing a pattern here. Whenever Fortnite adds a wacky skin, it's always so bulky like Bun Bun. The idea of a chocolate rabbit sounds incredible and whenever I see this guy I get kinda hungry, but obviously, it just didn't land with some players. Now we come to probably one of the most hated outfits of all time, Sakura.